YouTube, what's happening? You already know who it is, and you know what time it is. It's leg day. I ain't brought y'all no leg day in a long time. I know y'all thinking, damn, man, are you skipping leg day? You know better than that shit. Like I say, man, about to go over here and bang out legs. I already got kind of warmed up, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna let y'all follow me all the way through this session. It's not gonna be a lot of reps. It's just gonna be more heavy weight, and then I come back Saturday, and then I do the total opposite. That way I can just keep growing. That's all I wanna do right now, project growth. But like I say, let's go ahead and get to it. Make sure you stay tuned if you're trying to build them legs up. Alright YouTube, that was 390, I got it for 4 reps. I only supposed to do it twice, but it felt pretty light, so I had and went ahead for all of y'all. Everybody's watching the video, I did 2 extra squats for you. Just in case you got bad knees or a bad back and you can't squat but you want to. Those 2 reps were for you. But like I say, now I got 415, and I'm going to do it for a single. If the single goes up kind of quick, I'll go ahead and do it for a double. Like I say, this workout right here is just kind of heavy weight just to keep my strength up. Then I'll follow it Saturday with a lot less uh, weight, but I'll do a lot more reps. Like I say, my song's on, Young Jeezy. If anybody knows anything about Young Jeezy, go ahead and put your favorite Jeezy song down in the comment section. But right now, let's go ahead and bang this weight. Hi, right, strength team. The weight feels pretty good today. So it's probably my top set for my heaviest set. It's 435 pounds, so I'm just gonna try it for a nice single. All right, so now I'm just gonna keep on dropping the weight and I'm gonna do pause reps. All right, YouTube, now we're gonna get into the leg press. So I was gonna do front squats, but honestly, them pause reps, told my quads, then I ain't gonna do that shit. So instead of doing that, we're just gonna go ahead and jump with the leg press. We got four heavy ass sets, and you already know how I am. The last set is a triple drop set. You too. Y'all know how positive I am. I ain't never negative. I want to lip, lift, inspire, motivate everybody. But if you're in a gym and you've been in a gym for at least 30 minutes and your forehead don't look at least a little bit like it, you're wasting your time. You need to really just think about your goals. Write it out. Don't just be one of those type people that just goes to the gym and does whatever they feel like. Take you a time on Saturday, Sunday, write down everything you need to do for that week. That way you're prepared. The more prepared you are in life, the more successful you'll be. Now we'll go ahead and kill off our quads with the leg extensions. Y'all know that I'm very iffy on leg extensions because I really don't like it because it's so much, so much isolation. I really feel like your knee joints do a lot of more work than they really need to. But if done right, I think it's okay exercise. I don't use it all the time, but I do like to kill my quads off with it. So I'm gonna use moderate weight, and I'm gonna do four sets for 12 reps. The key with this is don't go all the way down, but go all the way up, and if you can, hold it for a brief second, and really squeeze, and then let it down slow, and repeat the process. Like I said, we got four sets for 12 reps. You do not have to go heavy, but at the same time, do not be using that baby weight. That baby weight's gonna only get your baby strong, and don't nobody wanna mess with no baby strong boy. All right, YouTube, our quads are done. If you, do this, if you do this workout and by now your quads ain't done, you need to go to the doctor and check your pulse because nine out of 10 times, actually 10 out of 10 times, your ass is a walking dead man. <laughs> Cause like for real, my quads are madly pumped. So what we're gonna do now, we're gonna go ahead and bang out our hamstrings. 
The first exercise, it's loud in here. Everybody likes to talk loud in the gym for some reason. First exercise, what we're gonna do is we're gonna do the stiff leg deadlifts. But as you'll see in the video, I put a plate and I literally stand up on that plate and it really just makes the emphasis concentrate way more on your hamstring. It makes it harder so you can't use that much weight, but that's even better because you don't have to use that much weight, but you still get the benefits. Like I said, we're gonna do four sets, so we're gonna stay between eight to 15 reps, so go kind of light. But anyways, like I say, stiff leg deadlift. Hey you two. Real, real sorry for cussing, but real shit. At 135, after about two or three sets of 12 to 15 reps, that shit felt like 295. Slow and control, feel the stretch, squeeze up with your hamstrings once you get to the top, don't fully lock it out, and then do it all over again. Four sets, and I think I was averaging 14 to 15 reps, and I'm done. But we just got started. So now we're gonna do the same exact movement, but we're gonna use dumbbells because I feel like you get a little bit better range of motion with it. So we're gonna do four sets, 12 to 15 reps with the dumbbells. That's kind of suicidal, but you know how crazy and silly my silly ass is. So let's get to it. So I can't keep no damn leg partner, or I can't keep no partner, period. They work out with me one time and they feel like they dead. Dead man walking. Hi YouTube. Like I said, we done banged out the quads, done banged out the hamstrings. Now we're just gonna finish uh, our hamstrings out with a little bit of isolation. So we're gonna do four sets between 12 to 15 reps of the lion leg curl machine. I'm not gonna show you every set because I don't want y'all be staring in my ass. Come on now, don't be playing that shit. Don't be playing that shit. <laughs> but for real though, I got four sets. I'm gonna say between 12 to 15 reps. Make sure you go kind of slow, like I always tell you. Make sure you're feeling the stretch and you're feeling the squeeze and the contraction, and that's it. Then we'll bang a little bit of uh, calves, and I think I'm gonna do a body physique update too. Let y'all see how sloppy I'm getting. 220 pounds, I'm starting to look sloppy. Hey, you can't say that shit, but I can say it. I'm starting to look sloppy. But I'm strong though. I'm getting strong though. All right, now I'm gassed, I'm all the way dead but I still gotta get these calves in. My calves are probably like 99% of all y'all's. My calves suck. My calves are not there. My calves need assistance. My calves need a disability check. Don't be making fun of my damn calves. The good thing is they're actually growing because when I first bought these leg sleeves about six months ago, they slid right past them. Now I gotta tug on them just a little bit. Not a lot, just a little bit. My favorite exercise, honestly, on my calves where I feel it the most every single rep, I do it on the leg press. You see behind me, I only got two plates, slow and controlled. I do like six sets of 12 to 15 reps, and that's it. I give it about 30 seconds between each set, and then I'm done. All right, you two. Like I said, I'm about to show y'all Physique update, don't be judging me. Like I said, I'm about 200 and I fluctuate between 219 and 222 pounds. Right now it's nine o'clock at night, so I'm probably about 221 pounds. But like I said, I'm gonna go ahead and do it. My posing sucks, but I'm gonna be practicing at least three times a week until I get closer to my show. And then I'll be practicing it probably at least two times a day. That way you can show off the package that you got. Yeah, there you go. Relax. 
But like I say, I hope you liked this video. It was a lot of raw footage. I hope everybody had a good holiday. Like I said in my last videos, man, keep getting them gains. Y'all probably see this video probably drop on like Friday. Keep getting them gains and holla at your boy.